and yeah we're chilling okay we're chilling right now i guess oh okay oh okay let's uh turbocharge that yo what is up guys Voltrix here back with a brand new video with today guys we're gonna be playing some more pits oh my freaking goodness i have not played my pit in so freaking long it feels like it's just been constantly freaking cc and also guys it is thanksgiving today so i hope you all have a great thanksgiving be thankful for who you have in your life your family friends all that jazz um and i wish you guys the best so of course for our first opponent we got mr willow which is pretty surprising uh because this looks like a cc opponent and we're a more pit what come on come on nk give me some better opponents please so we got the map ink block you know what i'm just gonna play it okay i just want a quick and easy game so i'm down boat boomer let's get it guys let's freaking get it so of course we're gonna be starting off with our farm and we're not gonna be able to farm that hard on this map it's a freaking short map but our first tower we're gonna be starting off with is the boat of course so i'm gonna have to get up our farm as soon as possible i'm gonna see what he's doing yeah okay okay he's sending that night glue okay okay a lot of people start off with using their glues not too sure why never 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 ever 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 do that okay that's not a good move what's so freaking ever because i can just easily get rid of it and it looks like he's going to be starting off with the triple dart monkey or the dart monkey not the triple dart monkey but the dart monkey so we're definitely going to be mixed equaling against this man i just want to see what i can do the damage that can be done to this man so we're probably going to layer over some round four blues and then pinks uh we'll see what he does it depends on if he wants to greet or not i feel like this guy is in the greedy type and yeah he definitely isn't so let's try to actually get a triple dart monkey out of him though i feel like maybe these yeah see i called it okay i was gonna say maybe these reds will and they freaking did ladies and gentlemen so we just got up another farm right there he has yet to send us absolutely anything which is a great thing uh but over time i'm gonna have to upgrade to the grape shot anyway so i might as well do it fuck it we're already out farming it's fine i'm gonna put this bad boy on last as well because the buccaneer on last on this map is oh freaking e let me tell you so we're probably going to send him nothing actually we're not going to send him anything for the meantime uh, we're going to try to focus on our farms a little bit because he can defend against space black space pinks all of that uh so uh yeah i'm I'm just gonna be chilling for now so he also has the wizard up there okay this is three tower by the way i just now noticed that so no freaking sneaky ass forts so he's going dart wizard which is actually not a bad strategy for this map i prefer boat though boat wiz or boat boomer uh but hey you can do whatever the hell you want man so he's going to send him yellows on round eight uh even though we're lacking in defenses right now so i'm gonna just get up a zero zero buccaneer right here uh just in case okay just in case and i'm thinking that he's going to be going for this next farm here because uh, we are out farming him so he should be trying to go for it uh but i'm going to immediately send yellows try to get a quick boost out of him or quick upgrade which that did force the upgrade of the lightning wizard so that is nice so now he's not going to be close to us in farms not at all we're just going to get the next farm because he's just not pressuring us although okay i'm kind of feeling that this guy would send us and maybe will send us regen yellows but looks like maybe he's not anymore so that's a good thing because he just upgraded to his second plantation we got our third plantation so we're looking pretty solid right now uh let's get up our lead detection of course which is going to be our boomer let's get up the red hot wings i think it's called not too sure don't quote me on it i'm gonna send him a freaking huge i mean huge white rush right here over top with pinks just to try to get a quick boost out of him hopefully he does boost and he does boost and mr willow is down to 69 lives okay all right don't laugh about that all right it's not funny all right so we're gonna have to get up the bionic boomer just in case uh yeah he's gonna be all out in us Ooh, okay go ahead do it do it you won't you won't you won't oh okay yeah so we're gonna be able to defend this with freaking ease and we're just gonna all out him right back even though our boost at does absolutely nothing whatever and it's gonna be a gg for mr willow and i so gg my friend i will catch you guys in the next one so we're back with the next opponent mr whiskers he looks pretty experienced not too many medallions though but quite a good badge quite a good record as well so that's a good thing what is it 82 percent? that's not bad whatsoever what is ours actually 72 okay we're trash okay we're trash we're, <laughs> we're not gonna talk about that industrial zone not gonna be playing on that map i'm gonna skip it water hazard okay i'm down for it i'm down for it 
Hopefully this guy doesn't go heli. Please don't go heli. Please don't go heli. Like, I really don't want this guy to go heli. I hate going against heli. I saw some of your comments about heli as well. I still personally think it's a broken tower. It just needs to be freaking nerfed. It's damaged for the piercing of the darts. It just needs to be nerfed and then I'd be fine with it. I mean, it just shreds through things, dude. It just shreds. But we're gonna get up our first farm and stop complaining about the goddamn heli. And we're gonna see what he's going with. I'm gonna guess it's either heli or boat. Please, please for the love of God, place down a boat. I want you to place down a boat. Yes, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, so he's probably going with the boat whiz strategy. Oh my God, we were a little bit late to send that eco, but it's all good. So we're gonna have to get up the Morbidans here as well. There we go. And we're not gonna upgrade to the grape shot unless he sends quite a bit, which he is so far. What the fudge? Okay, yeah, we're not gonna upgrade to the grape shot from that. Hell no, dude. Hell no, you gotta send us way freaking more. Um, but he's gonna continue to send actually. Um, I'm gonna get up the grape shot, <laughs> okay. God damn it! I freaking backed out, dude! Okay, I told myself. I was like, dude, I'm not upgrading. I will not upgrade, but I, I, I caved in. Okay, guys, I caved in. So we're gonna have to get up this next farm here, and he already got up his grape shot as well. So if he does want to send us some space pinks, that will be fine as well. I'm probably gonna put up my boat on close. Yes, here, here he goes with some pinks. Uh, so let's put it on close and we should be good we should be pretty good for the meantime um i don't care we're at 123 lives so we're gonna lives right now i'm not nervous about that whatsoever i'm gonna be focused on getting up this plantation and then i'll upgrade if needed which he's probably gonna constantly send actually no he stopped okay that's quite surprising i thought he would just constantly send we are down to one or two lives though uh, so we're gonna be a little bit cautious, I guess not really because I don't really worry when I'm at 100 lives It's not a big deal to me. So of course we're gonna be sending him some space blacks uh, to force a couple of upgrades on his side He's gonna have to get up the fast shooting He's gonna have to get up more than that actually and here he goes with an a zero zero boat as well um, And he has yet to send us anything on our side I guess I'm just gonna chill with what I got on my side for now uh, and He decided to sell that which is not a smart move because you're just gonna have to re-upgrade that so not too sure what you were thinking right there buddy but uh yeah just go ahead and build it up once again because it layers in really really nicely with the round 7 ai so he did end up upgrading once again down to 95 lives 82 81 he's leaking quite a bit actually he has two freaking grape shots one with a fast shooting so we're gonna have to get up this next farm as well um uh, my farm positions are just trash right now oh my god holy shit um yeah we're gonna have to boost that of course and he's gonna constantly send he's still sending why are you still sending okay holy shit holy shit okay so <laughs> that was quite surprising not too sure why he thought that was a good move because now i'm just gonna be out farming him by a lot right now so i'm not too sure what he was thinking right there let's get up the next farm as well and let's also send a lead on his side uh to force a couple of upgrades we got our boomer of course and he's going for that next farm he said fuck you i don't care dude i don't give a shit and wow he doesn't have wizard what <laughs> he doesn't have wizard either okay all right pretty interesting pretty freaking interesting uh we're gonna have to get up another farm so i'm gonna get up this farm right here i'm really greedy well not like really greedy i'm kind of being greedy uh because i still just have this little zero zero bomb tower let's get up this and let's put it on strong uh because it's kind of scaring me okay it's kind of scaring me and let's also get up this oh my god he's sending us quite a bit holy shit okay i'm just gonna set down a glue i was kind of scared right there not gonna lie i was really freaking scared holy shit okay yo you're greeting way too hard buddy you are greeting way too freaking hard go ahead and get up some defenses man jesus oh my god it's so weird how to defend rushes or send rushes i mean all right and there's a boost though so that's a good thing he has yet to use any of his glues though he's gonna try to out farm us no it ain't happening buddy it ain't happening because we're just gonna boost regen leads at you yep okay all right that's fine that's fine all right so yeah we're gonna definitely send him a rerush of regen leads or just regular leads and then regen uh just to see what he does because he has really weak freaking uh lead detection right now and yeah that should definitely freaking scare him he's gonna have to use some glues or something or else mr whisk is gonna die but he has the spike storm okay all right see you just gotta love powers man you just gotta freaking love them okay so yeah we're just gonna straight up turbocharge this because this is way too many freaking camos um so yeah turbocharge will be easily able to defend against that which is a good 
thing. So let's get up our vinyl boomer once again. Let's build up this farm, build it back up. There we go, we're looking pretty solid. And another camel rush, okay. I'm just gonna have to turbocharge that once again. Um, I will get up another uh, boat because he keeps on sending me camel rushes. So let's get up this. Okay, there we go. And we have to watch out for our Moab anyways. And he has pretty weak uh, Moab popping power on his side as well. So we're gonna have to get up this. Let's get up a zero zero right here. And yeah, we're chilling. Okay, we're chilling right now, I guess. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Let's uh, turbocharge that. And let's turbocharge this. We should be good. Oh my God, no! How does two turbochargers not defend? Oh my God. All right, GG, dude, GG. How does two turbochargers not defend? I had to sell all of my freaking farms. Good game, man. I will see you guys in the last one. Fucking hell. So we are back with the last opponent, Kenny. How does two turbochargers not defend a fucking boosted mob? Please, somebody tell me that. Boosted! Boosted too. How? Holy shit. Okay, whatever. We're just gonna forget about that. Let's go. No, I wanted to go to the Spike Factory strategy. Damn you. Okay, we're not playing on park. No, thank you. That map is pretty long. Okay, Zen Garden. You know what? I'm freaking down. All right, Boat Boomer. Let's get it. All right. I think we've won Boat Boomer every game. <laughs> Boat Boomer, yes. The sweatiness of Boat Boomer. We freaking love it. We freaking love it. So, um, Kenny's going to have to pick a strat. There he goes. And we're just going to get right into this. So, let's set down our first farm. He's going to be starting off with the Dart Monkey. All right. Immediately setting down that Dart Monkey. So, I'm guessing he's going to Eco. But he could also be one of those players that just likes to set down the tower at first. Who knows? I don't know. But, no, he's going to be Ecoing. He's going to be Ecoing on the map Zen Garden. You don't want to be equaling on a map like this, guys. Don't. It's not worth it. It is not worth it. Farms are much freaking better. They're much more efficient. I'm telling you guys, just go with farms. Don't eco on small maps because you're just going to be fucked late game. You're, you're definitely going to be fucked late game. Uh, or not even late game. I mean, kind of late game uh, with like round 20, uh, even mid game and stuff like that. So yeah, it's just not freaking worth it. So we're already down to 90 lives though. Okay. 89 actually. So, I mean, hey, I guess you could say, yeah, he has the advantage right now, but no, it's not going to be like that for long. It's not going to be like that for long. So we're just going to get up another grape shot as well, uh, because he's going to be sending us some eco. Uh, never mind. He just stopped. Okay. So we're definitely going to be sending him some space pinks though on his side uh, to force a few upgrades and only one of his dart monkeys can hit those space pinks. <laughs> yes. Oh my God. He's going to have to upgrade another triple dart monkey or maybe a zero two. I'm going to force. Yeah, I'm fucking forcing that triple dart. There we go. All right. So Kenny's down to 95 lives. We're looking pretty good. Not on farms though. Okay. Our farms are slacking a little bit. Not going to lie. We we'll have to get up this banana plantation. So let's get up this. There we go. And it looks like we're pretty good. Okay. We're pretty good on defenses. Um, I kind of over defended for round four uh, because he didn't even eco at all. So I didn't even really uh, need another boat, but whatever. Okay. It's all fine. So he's going to be boosting, I'm guessing space blacks. No. Okay. So greens. Okay. Yeah. That could hurt us up. That could hurt us a little bit. Uh, I'm going to set down the glue. Okay. I'm going to set down the glue just in case, just to help us out a little bit as well. Um, and he's going to continue to boost these. Okay. That's nice. That's nice. Yep. Keep on sending them, Kenny. Keep on motherfucking sending them. Okay. All right. All right. I like your game fucking style, I guess. I don't, I didn't know what to say right there. Okay. But I like the way you play, Kenny, okay? I like it. So we're definitely going to have to punish you for sending all of those, okay, man? We're going to have to. We're going to have to. So we're just going to send him some yellows on his side. And, oh, he's going to get up another triple dart monkey. That's not going to do anything, buddy. Kenny, you need more than that, dude. You need way more than that. And there's a boost. Okay, easy-ass boost. And there is his first monkey glue yes okay we love the monkey glue oh my god it just makes eco so weird i don't know i'm sending him more yellows though i want him to use all this fucking monkey glues no get your heli out of here get your goddamn heli out of here yes okay we got all the monkey glues out the way though okay they're all out the way now Woo! that's awesome and he's just spamming triple darts on his side we're gonna have to send him a lead we're gonna have to get up some lead detection as well though jesus this is this is kind of not looking good for us, not going to lie. This is not looking too great. Uh, but is he going to die to the space lights? Will he? Will he die to the space lights? Oh my god, he's going to die to the space lights. Kenny! 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 No, Kenny! Don't die! He's dead. Yeah. Oh, oh, does he clutch it? Nope. Okay. Interesting. Okay. 
All right, GG, Kenny. All right, that, that was a weird game, not gonna lie. But that's where I'm gonna wrap up the video. I hope you guys did enjoy. Make sure to drop a fat like if you did. And also, if you have not already, make sure to click that subscribe button. And another thing, please join my Discord server. The link's in the description below. Follow me on all my socials. And if you guys like to watch live streams, I do live stream on Twitch. There's a link down below. All the links are down below. Just check them out. So the last question I asked you guys in the last video was, who is my favorite NBA player? And the answer is LeBron James. So this guy won. Congratulations, man. Yes, I am a fucking proud Bron sexual, okay? I do not care. LeBron is the GOAT in my book, all right? And his career still yet to be over. So, yeah, that's just my favorite player. I'm actually from Cleveland, from around Cleveland, so I'm a Cavs fan, you know. We drafted him. Yeah, he's in L.A. now, but I still support him. So, congratulations, man, on your childhood. So, next question I'm going to be asking you guys is, what is my favorite food to eat on Thanksgiving? All right, favorite Thanksgiving food. Make sure to leave your answers down below in the comment section, and you may have the chance to win a shout-out in the next video, which is obviously dope. I hope you guys did enjoy. Once again, it's been your Wobble. Peace out, everybody.